because Mikey is a good player, but um, I think Anderson should be able to win this one. My prediction is 2 to 1. I think he loses keep. Oh, Anderson loses his map choice. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious. Mikey is. Uh, I'm not saying he has bad mechanics, but he's not not uh, basing his game on his mechanics. So this is going to be very interesting. I think Ennis going to take it as well, but I'm going to say 2-1 to one too. Ennis, though, yep. spawns at the, the uh, shotgun and this resulting in him picking up the heavy immediately. And now they fight already and Mikey is playing hard to get with the shotgun, but he orbs back into... Ennis's face who has yeah. the perfect MLP weapon. MLP already has a good amount of stack. And, uh, off he goes. Ooh, do nothing already. That's not the start Mikey wanted. Oh, but there's a mega winning for him. Ah, I can grab it in time. Nothing Mikey can really do here. Oh, and he gets trapped at spawn. Tried to use the orb to fake himself out, but the orb doesn't work. Uh, NSC is keeping Mikey on a string right now. Yeah, NSC is really uh, locking Mike up in, in a certain part of the map and not having lightning on the area just made it a little bit easier for Mike to survive, but. Yeah, and as he picked up a 50 box, and he literally muddled to melted Mikey down in one second, despite him getting the mega mid fight. And as his aim is looking solid, seems like he's very well able to carry over all of his momentum from yesterday because he's yeah. just not stopping. It's six frags in one minute thirty. That was my prediction. <laughs> yeah, I think that they go. Uh, they are going a lot of people's predictions for this. But in the end, this is still uh, NSC's map pick. And 1 HP as well. I mean, now, now it's even... Uh, yeah, he has even Fortune on his side as well. This is a tough game for Mike. Yeah, Fortune and skill on your opponent's side. That's not an easy combo to deal with. But Mikey will be able to seal this heavy. Uh, and uh, maybe stop the bleeding a little bit. He did not pick up the heavy. Mikey left it up for grabs. Oh, and this he's... time the heavy. Ennis is completely unaware, of course. Yeah, and this will, will result in Mikey not being able to pick it up because of the location of the fight was in middle, and this resulted in Ennis spawning at nail room, which, yeah, Ennis most people rotate to the heavy then. Gun. Isn't this should... Oh, oh, no. oh 30 HP, I was gonna say. This is a very good position for Mikey to get some some frags back for himself because he locked up NSC at, at the statue, basically, but Mike had so little stack to work with that in the end, NSC came out on top anyway. It's always good for NSC if he spawns near his favorite weapon. <laughs> Oh, look at the trade, oh, though, the flames. That was a decent trade for um, for Ennessy as well, because Mikey now doesn't have any weapons. And he even sees the trap coming from a mile away. Yeah, and Mikey... Ennessy locked Mike up for so long that he could not make it over for heavy in time to really contest it. So this was a rather clean picker, but after the fact... Mikey shoved his, uh, his shotgun down Ennis's arm and just completely blew it up. So, kind of the control, despite dying, went into his hands now. But, yeah, control don't really always mean freck, so he still needs to find fights he wins to make this comeback. I mean, seven frags in, in six minutes in this map is more than doable. Obviously, we have seen a lot more frags already. But the damage output from NSC is just too big. The shotgun almost clutches it out again for him, but Mike oh, gets one on the board for him. Oh, control back. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, Mikey didn't even bother showing up at the Mega. Oof. That's a tough one. <clears throat> Mikey was probably... He uh, ducked away from him, from him in his own screen. 
Oh, here we go, another LG fight. Oh no, Mikey got on the... Ah, uh, my... Mikey got caught on the jump pad. Yeah, it sealed his fate. I mean, he could have done a... a, a it, it was an unfavorable fight for him anyway. But being trapped on the bounce pad just made him die without being able to really return fire. And Ennis, he's just adding insult to injury now, going up the bounce pad himself and just shredding Mike apart with shotgun and flame strike. And another frag, not a single lightning gun cell was missed, it feels like. And Mikey, yeah, Mikey has had enough. A little bit of a beating here from NSC. But uh, maybe it's today that uh, NSC finally makes it and goes on to play FaZe Odegon. Well, that was over uh, quick. <laughs> uh, yeah, but... Did we hit the five minute mark? I think we, we just did, right? Barely. Yeah, barely, I think. Barely. Well. But yeah, this map was decided in the first two minutes. I think uh, it was 8 0 until uh, Mikey got uh, his first in on the scoreboard. So, yeah, he had so much work to do uh, after uh, the first track. Then then there was some trading going on also uh, in the control, but NSC already uh, sealed the deal. So, yeah, he, uh, like you said, Jones, he's just uh, uh, continuing his streak that he built yesterday. As, um, he said in chat uh, that he uh, was playing more aggressive uh, than he already did. And it looks to me that he's uh, <laughs> still u uh, using that tactic. And on CK, it's, it's, it's great to get that amount of frags in a short uh, time. Yeah, I think so as well. I mean, he used his aggression in, in this case, especially to uh, lock up uh, Mike in certain parts of the map. But I'll leave you two guys to find out whether he can do this on a bigger map like Molten Poles as well. Oh, thank you. You're very kind. <laughs> yeah, and, and oh, this is interesting. Uh, the BJ Blazkowicz as a counter to Visor. Two, one. Fight. Yeah, but uh, either way, Mikey spawns at the rocket launcher and uh, NC at the LG. Oh, Mikey will be delaying that uh, mega in order to get that LG for himself. NC will probably try to deny it. No, he does come to the rocket launcher. Oh, that was a very good uh, direct, and um, Mikey pops the preemptive dual wield. Yeah, actually both players delayed their items, so there's not much of a split. Yeah, a couple of seconds, not enough in this map to challenge for both. Oh, but Ennessy uh, takes position for the heavy, so they trade items. Or no, it's uh, Mikey who gets the mega health, which was also the first item he took. Yeah, Mikey taking the trade. Um... Well, he hears the visor popping his ability, so he escapes. There oh, should be there is an attack. Oh, the dual plunk. oh, but he does. Oh, Why did he stop? Does so much damage. Oh, he doesn't hit the rail, and he's really worse for wear. But he does vacate the area, and there is no angle anymore for Ennessy. Oh, it very good rail! All of a sudden, the tables have turned. Yeah, now Ennessy has to be careful. Oh, that's a ton of damage from Mikey. And it's in hot water. No! <laughs> Mikey goes out of the map. Bye bye. Not like this. Oh, uh, but he ha he spawns at rail and just gambles on his aim. Uh, he does connect a rail. No, he, he didn't uh, hit anything. Unfortunately, the gamble failed. And Anasi uh, has the armor to stack back on. So yeah, he has a reason to be here. But he was a little bit early. Oh. And Mikey uh, seals the deal with his LG. I, I, uh, who, who took the Mega Health in this instance? I think M Mikey stole it just before NSC could take it, right? Uh, yeah, looks, uh, looks that way. 
Ah, oh, but Mikey, um, trying to deal safe damage from afar. We see the BJ passive coming in. He does not have any armor, and NSC is checked as fuck. <laughs> and <laughs> Mikey he makes it even easier for NSC to get a frag. Yeah, it just goes up the jump pad against an LG. <laughs> yeah, he does not survive. Surprise. Oh, oh. no, another LG fight. Time to die. Oh, NSC runs out. Oh no, one more tick was gonna be enough and he runs out of LG, that's... that's tough. Yeah, indeed. Uh, Mikey wasn't really aware that NSC was chasing him up. Oh, but... <laughs> and again! Mikey! Uh, yeah, just moving around and not really aware where NSC is uh, moving to, so he gets so much damage on return. And yeah, and as he gets uh, another clean frag. Oh, <laughs> almost steps oh, out of the map. Oh, my the beat. <laughs> Isn't he? I'm no, list me. Is he aware that the mega elves? Yeah. Okay, so. He is. He just wanted to make sure that you could damage his opponent if you were in LG. Oh, good rail from Annecy. Um, he's getting a lot of good trades and they're gonna meet again. Another LG fight, absolutely favoring Annecy. Yeah, four minutes in. Uh, the scoreline is closer than last map, but uh, if you look at the control Annecy is uh, working with, Mikey has a tough job of uh, getting into this map. Yeah, um, absolutely he does. Mikey does have five magics, but uh, no heavies. And it looks like it's gonna continue. The screaming BJ. Ooh, even with a shotgun from that position, Ennis takes it. Yeah, and it looks like Ennis isn't really looking for a fight. He just wants to uh, keep his control. But every time Mikey appears, he Ennis has so much stack to work with, and all, also his weapon selections is just uh, the damage output is is just not there for Mikey to to mitigate the control Ennis is having. Another one of these fights. Annecy though quite low, but uh, yeah, there's a mega. Yeah, I, I, it may have been a good investment if Mikey just straight away could go on with the damage uh, he done uh, before he died. Oh, again with that jump. Mikey finally getting a heavy, but uh, I don't think it will be enough even to survive this fight. But at least NSC is not in control now. Yeah, I think this is the first item since uh, three or four rotations. Uh, Mikey is getting one. And uh, now he needs tracks. He has uh, four minutes to do so. A little bit less even. But no, he four walks minutes. away. He, he gives away uh, position on the heavy. Yeah, maybe trying to be too aggressive on the damage without knowing where his opponent is. Oh, perfect trap from Annecy, just not the HP to back it up. Oh, that was almost a perfect rocket from Mikey. But he gets the job done in the end. Too bad is a little bit low. Yeah, and, and now the difference in those uh, these two players is that uh, Endesi, after a fight, he always fell back on the major item. And now Mikey, I don't think he uh, even has timing for most of the rotation we had uh, this map. So three minutes left and uh, Endesi stopped the small gap comeback mikey was having well i don't think it was really a comeback he got a frag but he did not win control back no he didn't put himself into a situation where he could mount 
um, mount a few more frags without having to work a lot harder to get back into control. So, but uh, NSC now not even worried about uh, getting the frags, he's worried about uh, keeping Mikey as low as possible. And of course, in order to get this mega, you have to get this frag. Again, NSC for who goes for the LG aggression. Oh, but a couple of rails, very good ones from Mikey as well. Uh, but now Mikey just needs to beeline to the heavy. Oh, he doesn't have a lot of tools. Oh, no. uh, yeah, he's missing rockets in his arsenal. Oh, the LG is a good choice, though. Wow, even yeah, good uh, enough to finish the job. Very good dodge on the plasma, I gotta say. True. Yeah, had uh, nice dance moves. Nice ah. dance moves or ankle breakers, <laughs> yeah. one or the other. Now he's overstaying his welcome. He, uh, he wanted a little bit too much LG in the face, which isn't that healthy. And oh, they lo I think he still loses out on position on the heavy. Oh, well, he was earlier there than Ennis he was. Yeah, now Ennis, he does not ha really have enough uh, LG ammo for this fight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I always find it interesting how both of these players are always looking for fights at the LG area. Yeah. And you that is watch. actually costing them items in the position. One minute the last warning. time that Ennis tried it, he got fragged. True. There, yeah. But there's only a minute left. He, he takes the heavy, so he has some stack to soak up uh, the LG in the next fight. And yeah, now uh, Mikey is the one that does not have a lot of LG ammo. Well, oh, that was uh, very good starting damage from um, Mikey, but Annecy follows um, up with some brilliant rails. Yeah, this map is uh, done and dusted, and uh, NSC uh, takes the first map. Oh, we still have 10 seconds! Oh, okay, Let's go. yeah, yeah. There, <laughs> there is still time. It's just not enough. Yeah, Mikey, even... You win. ...throwing in the celebratory suicide. That's true. So at least he got the last track. It was only on his own. So yeah. NSC uh, moves on through and Mikey uh, has to try his luck uh, next week. <laughs>